washer on the top of the spinning the nut back up to uh, tighten it. Pull the throttle open and let this go. I'm going to lose that thing now. Looks like she's okay. Now I must put on the claw. that nut to actually cinch it. Now what I could have done, I usually get away without doing it though, is uh, I could have installed this cable here before I actually tighten down the manifolds so I could have moved the whole carburetor assembly around a little bit. It would have given me a little more clearance. much coming. Got about one. You have to get a 10 millimeter on the other end of it. So now, hopefully the choke will be a little easier. I'm going to bring the choke in. Time looking like Eddie. All right, well, it's about 12.50 after 12. Okay, let's see. We got the fuel on. Let's see. Yeah, we better get a little more slack in this puppy here. I think we can. Sure about that I.O. yet. I might might have a false limiter. I think so. Oh gosh. Well, pretty easy time to change that. Well, you got that together in pretty good time. What's that? You got that together in pretty good time. You know. 
what I think I'm going to do, I've got it on, I'm going to put the support bolt cables on, and now I'm going to, uh, just in case we're running close to 15 minutes, what's it say here? Oh gosh, there, there's a software update. Uh, now available. Well, I don't think we're going to do it right now, but I'm going to go and shut this video off and start another one there to, uh, just for a little finishing up before we fire it. Be firing it real soon.